Yeah. You look like that funk. The future's now. Alright, hello chat. Alright, so we're at the grand, fire, grand final of the loser bracket. We're in the loser semi right now. And... Let me see, hold on. That's not the button. I thought it's only people in your room. Or is it just anybody? Oh, contacts, okay. You know, because I mean, are you gonna raise your wrist when you see a movie? It's not like a road. Your watch goes off. <laughs> Have you guys seen Annabelle? I already saw it, but you guys should definitely go, still go see it. Yeah, you got, you need to go see Annabelle. Do do you want to know what it's actually about? There's an A story and there's a B story. There's the actual thing that goes on, and then there's do you want to know the B story, the side story? It's about a girl who's having trouble making friends, and she's at a birthday party, and now it's the girl sleepover movie. You ever seen that sleepover movie with uh, Alexa Vega from Spy Kids? Or any so yeah, so it's that but spooky. It's, it, you would think it's about demons. It's way more about the sleepover party. Annabelle, the new one. The new Annabelle movie. Annabelle comes home. Chick flick. 100% chick flick. Oh, well, 98%. No, 80%. There, there's 100% spooky price. But the other, the other story, it overpowers it so much. It's so much more of that other movie. But it was good. <laughs> Wait, so who won? Oh, well, yeah. He's on double handicap. You're only on single handicap. Are you looking at Disneyland Paris? Or Disney Paris. He cannot, that's why he's losing. He's buzzed and he's on the Kanye shutters. Take him off! You need a win! So you can fight me! Disneyland Paris has the weirdest blockouts. Disneyland Paris has the weirdest blockouts. It's just all the Wednesdays of July don't come to Disney. Oh no, that's Florida. Okay. Yeah, I told you it's Florida. No, it's the weirdest blockouts for Florida. It's every Wednesday of July, don't come. It's a J. <laughs> but it, I guess it's also a Phoenix. Yeah? Groupon? It is, yeah. Oh shit. That sucks. I heard their Marvel Land is open sooner, or something like Epcot's supposed to be Guardians area now. Yes, yeah, the like Guardians of the Galaxy at Epcot Center. Hollywood Studios. Now or is it like in a little bit? That's what I thought. Cause I know Florida's getting Tron, like this year, if not already. Yeah. In China. They're going to. No, Avatar. But the Avatar ride is dope. I've never been there. It's like going to Zorn around the world. You have different events. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. I thought it was like Pirates of the Caribbean. Yeah. There's one that's in the world. The other one is just like... The bull ride is okay. It's not like how it's creepy. What else? Oh! 
If any of us was an attractions cast member, an attractions lead, they're already starting to test and adjusting for um, Spider Man. Which means. No, but you literally have to go like either tomorrow or Friday to do the Spider Man ride. Cam? Sweet, go do the Spider Man ride. Do the Spider Man ride. I need to do food for. I'm gonna do Ant Man's Microbrew. They actually almost finished building it. Do you walk through tram or no? Like if you take the tram into DCA and then you walk on the second stop, you can see some of the Marvel Land that's already finished. So beer can is almost done, and so is some of the Spider-Man ride. I think it's weird that they're already doing tests and adjusts because it does not look finished. But wait, are they expanding the, uh, the Marvel Land, or are they just keeping it short like that? It's expanded, which is kind of a problem for the Cars Land people. Because the characters, like, it's, it's expanding into where their tents are, so they're gonna have to move farther back or something like that. They store the cars, like, in the. The cars are, like, right next to Guardians, but it looks like they're already building the Marvel stuff into Guardians. Next time you go on the tram, yeah, next time you go on the tram, go on the